third time that I was in show, would you believe me? Because it is. Hey, what's up? It's Maya. Welcome back to my channel. So today we're going to be talking about my plants because the last time that you saw them, the army was a lot smaller. The gang, the homies. I have a plant addiction, okay? And what started off as just, I think, what, three? Three plants has quickly turned um, into this. He's an OG and he's also mad upset with me right now. Like, he can't even with me because I left him outside. I got sick, by the way, and um, yeah, I left all of them outside for a while. He's also mad at me. Ignore them. They they, they normally look better than this, but uh, I'm just now starting to feel better after feeling sick for like, what, a week? It wasn't the Rona. I don't, we don't know what it was, but I was on my butt for like a week and they got sunburned and then frostbite at night. <sighs> I know, but they're they're still alive. They're still surviving. They're survivors, Destiny's child or whatever, you know. I was like, they're, 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 they're okay. Don't come for me. Yeah, they're plant children. Take five, honestly. I am so rusty at filming videos that this is like my third time filming this. It's ridiculous, but enjoy. So y'all probably remember Ray, he was one of the first, no, he was the first plant that I bought. I got him at H-E-B forever ago. He grew a lot of new fronds. Some of them are dying off, but he has a new one coming up, which is great. And then I think he has another one. Yeah, he has two new fronds coming up, which is great. Then we have my fiddle, who's doing good. He seems happy, so. You know, at least he's healthy. Then we have my pothos. I'm gonna hang him up eventually, but for now I have him on this because like I said, I haven't been feeling well and he's grown a ton since y'all last saw him. Let me lift him up so y'all can see. He's grown a ton and that makes me so happy. I have to cut him back and do more, but he's thriving, he's happy. And then we have my Dracaena. I don't know how to pronounce it, but this is the one that I rescued from my mom. I'll put a clip somewhere of what he used to look like, but he's grown. Oh, he's so much happier now. And you're probably thinking like, Maya, where's the third one? So the third one literally had this tiny little worm. I honestly still don't know what kind of worm it was, if we're being completely frank. I really. I have no clue, but I just know that they was eating him, and I said, you know what? I'm gonna just quarantine you, and then he ended up dying, but the rest of them are thriving, so we lost one, but the other two are living their best life, if you will. So they're still alive. And then, oh my. I swear I'm a good plant parent, I swear. But this is another plant that a friend gave to me. I don't know what kind of plant it is. But um, doing well, this is a split leaf monstera, a plant that I've really been wanting and a friend gave it to me and I love her so much. Like, oh my goodness, I love her so much. Her leaves are growing funny though. Like this leaf grow, it's growing backwards. Like what? But anyway, that's how she wants to grow. Then that's how she's gonna grow. I have my little tomato plants. And we have Sunny's child. Then we have this guy who literally got crusty in the sun. And I don't know if he's going to come back, but I'm still watering him. And I'm hoping that he'll come back, but I really don't know if he's dead or not. And then we have an aloe that also got sunburnt. It's not like everyone got sunburnt or anything, but... It's actually growing new little offshoots down there. I don't know if y'all can see them. And he grew a new leaf, so I think he's gonna be okay. I also have this little guy. Don't know what kind of plant he is, but he was also a gift from a friend. So, was this spider plant. He's still very small, but he'll grow more. But he is doing really, really well. He's happy. And then we have this, I think it's called a wandering Jew. He called, my neighbor called it something different. The, I got two cuttings 
from my neighbor. Thank you. And then I have this succulent, which I also don't know what it's called, but it's beautiful. I have it in a pasta sauce jar because I ran out of pots. And then I have this Marble Queen Pothos who she grew a lot. She was in my last video and look at how much she's grown. This is a new pot, by the way, this is a bigger one. Then we have another tomato plant. Hopefully we'll grow bigger. Then over here we have, we have a snake plant. And then we have poor baby Sunny who is sunburnt. I'm hoping that if I just leave her here, that she'll recover and come back. This would not have happened if I hadn't gotten sick though. Then we have, I, I don't know if this is an elephant ear, exactly. But my friend also gifted me this plant. And a lot of these plants have grown a lot of new leaves. When she first gave me this one, it just had these two. And then it grew a third one, it's about to get a fourth one, which I'm excited about. It's so stinking cute, I love her. And Sir Breaks a Lot is still alive. And this was another gift from a friend. And this one is very interesting. So it used to have a lot more leaves, but they just all started dying off. And I was very scared that this plant was going to die before I had the chance to put it in soil. But if you look in the water, there's actually another leaf growing so i'm just leaving it in the water and hoping for the best but i just thought that the it was a trailing play it was so beautiful when she gave it to me and then i was like oh my gosh girl the leaves are building up so sad. if you follow me on instagram you've probably seen the majority of these plants but this one was the one that i gave to my friend who i made ramen for and still going strong though a little sunburnt still going strong then we have my parents' orchid, which has grown like crazy since I took her in and rescued her. So I used to just have the two leaves, and now she has like six or whatever, growing like crazy, and I am very happy that she's growing that much. Then we have, I don't know what this plant is called, but also another gift, and it's grown like crazy as well. It was just a little teeny tiny cutting when she gave it to me, and now it's grown like a lot. Very happy. And we have the aloe that started it all back there. She got a little sunburn, but she's actually come back a lot since the sunburning. And she's used to that because she's the one that I, y'all remember her, I cut the roots off of her. Yeah, she's grown a lot. So we have another aloe and this one has even more babies. Like I never knew aloes sprouted off little babies until this one started sprouting off babies. It's the cutest stinking thing ever. <sighs> so yeah, sorry. <sighs> Got a little out of breath. That's almost all of my plants. For the last one, we have to go to my bedroom. But here's what my living room looks like as of late. It's way too cold to leave them outside. But anyway, to my bedroom. These are where I keep my peppers, and they're not doing too good just because it's winter time. But I have jalapenos that I probably should pick, but I want to see if they'll get a little bit bigger. And then I have habaneros as well. And I had a bell pepper, but then these little, those same little tiny bugs that killed the other plant came to this one. So, I don't know, she has a little tiny stem that's starting to grow back, so I'm just trying to keep on watering her. Ignore that good over there also, y'all, I'm sorry. I'm, I need to get them post, but, I mean, they've, they've grown pretty big, like, look at how big he is. He's thriving, he's happy. So, that is an updated plan tour. Thank you guys for watching so, 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 so much. Don't forget to please subscribe and like if you like this video. Leave me a comment down below if you have any plants similar or what you think of my plants, if you have any names for them. Because not all of them have names. It's pretty much only Sunny, Ray. That's it. <coughs> and I kind of call kind of call him Junior just because that's this plant is an offshoot of this guy. So that's why I call him Junior sometimes, but 
the other plants need names and i just got in these super cute plant hangers from amazon and i'm really excited about them i'll probably give y'all an update when i hang those up or if you want to see me hang them up let me know and i'll leave them linked below the ones that i got it was a pack of six of them six of them yeah so i'm excited for that it's just I wanted to hang them up, but I just wasn't, I was just too weak to do it. I'm still kind of too weak to do it, if I'm completely honest, but I'm just trying, you know, uh, to handle my business. If y'all enjoyed this video, once again, I already said this, thumbs up, but you know, it's whatever. Oh, actually, actually, let me show y'all some more cute stuff that I got from Amazon. So I really don't know what to do with these rocks, but Look at how cute this watering can is. I got this off of Amazon and it came with the cutest little plant mister. And I just keep those up here cause they're cute. But I also have a heavy duty watering can that I do the bulk of my watering with when I have them like outside or like when I fertilize them. And this one I got from Lowe's. One last sweep of all my plants. So thank you once again for watching, and do you like my shirt? It's good at Thelma. I got it at Ross. It's adorable. But anyways, thank you for watching, and um, bye. Wait, actually, I need my hug. Thank you. Bring it in. Bring it in. Mm -hmm. Okay, I can leave. Bye. It's so pretty.